Hi Pisces! Welcome to my channel. We're doing your December bi-weekly. This is going to be for the 16th towards the end of the year. Pisces! Okay, so this is going to be for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We're going to see here two energies. Pick which side you are and then we'll go deeper in it. And at the same time in our extended reading, we'll see how it closes this year and how we wrap all the energies that you guys have been going through for this past 2017. A wonderful way to close the year. All right, so here we go, Pisces. Link is down there, open the show more box, or how other people call it, the description box. All right, let's see here, Pisces. Okay, here we go. You have here, sorry for the glare, but this is a new deck also. You have there, Four of Pentacles. One is very much, okay, taking things, to a level where they don't want to share. They want to hug everything to themselves. You know, we all know that this is the greedy card, but from what I'm sensing with the Four of Pentacles, always like they can't offer much. If they can't offer much, then they have nothing but themselves. So they take themselves very seriously, and that's why they're very protective. People think they have a wall. In reality, they just know their self value. Four is number of stability. Then you have the other person. I don't see it. Oh, wow. The other person is Four of Wands. I just said. Four is number stability. So Pisces, the energy here of the other person, one's relationship, one's commitment, the other person is not ready. Okay, plain and simple. Meaning this is the receiving and giving energy. There's one that's going to be the, uh, I mean, of course, the one who's giving, the one who's giving the attention, and the other one is not ready to open up and reciprocate. This is the initial energy. So if this is the energy now, let's proceed. Four of one's fire sign, earth sign, of course, and the other side. Let's see here, Pisces, okay. The one who's not ready to open up. I'm gonna see now the transit of the energies with three cards over here. What's been going on? You have your six of wands. I'll show you it later on. The devil card, Capricorn energy. Everybody got the devil card. I, um, from what I'm sensing, since everybody got the devil card, guys, it's about people are not being smart with the way that they deal with their soulmate. The karma is still here. This is Saturn. And the Empress, love. Oh, this is a lot of sex and baby. Okay, with the other four of pentacles. Maybe this person is not ready. They have sex. I mean, not that they have sex. They have babies. We have the Empress card. Now here with the four of ones. Let's have here. Oh, wow. The full card. Going with the flow. Justice. They want to claim victory. Major Arcana, guys. And the last card, five of pentacles. I knew that's going to come out. Mm -hmm. Anyhow, let's start here. The lowdown. You have your six of ones. The Devil card and the Empress. Okay, so this person is not ready to open up, not ready to return whatever this other person is giving. Okay, they want their freedom. The Six of Wands energy is they come back from a travel, they're going to be successful and everybody's going to be talking to them. Person gives advice to people. With the Devil card over here though, they're very attached still to the other person. They still love the other person, but first card is the strongest, regardless of the major arcana. Four of Pentacles here, I'm not ready. I may have loved you, Venus, relationship, creation, loving, nurturing, but I can't give you myself right now. Four of Pentacles. Four is, you can get stuck, I mean, with, the, with number four, here's, here's the tricky part with number four. It is you who choose how long you stay there. Other numbers, you can't, okay? Five, you can't, you can't stay there. Nine, being single, you can't stay there. Um, eight um, is number of growth, so you can't stay there. Seven is conflict also. Six is stable. So four and six, you, you can stay there as much as you'd like. Now, you're dealing with someone, okay, if this is, if this is not you, Piscean, with a four and six. So tell me now, when are they going to move? Because they won't, okay? Four is stable, six is stable. They like what they have right now. But they're very much all still connected with this energy, the Capricorn energy, which means there's attachment, the shackles is not yet let go. Okay? Also, remember when a devil cards with me, whatever it links to, it gets extra. So meaning this person gets extra attention, gets extra protection, and gets extra love. Alright? They have good energy extra. Now, other person who wants the relationship over here, the four of wands, wants something stable. Let's grow together. Let's grow old together, okay? They have the full card. They're going to take a chance on this person. No matter what this person does, okay, who's ever not ready, they're the full card. I don't care. I'll still do it. I'll still do it. I don't care, okay? Red flags are everywhere. I don't care, 
Okay? The cliff is right there. I don't care. You know, I, I, I want to learn about you. I want to know you. That's a full card. A traveler, a single person. They have justice card, meaning they want to claim victory, right? Because they're going to scale things down. All right. So where do I put you in my life? In this, in this, in this. They found out the truth. Oh, you know what? I don't care about the truth. I just want to take a chance. Okay? That's the full card. Now, they have five of pentacles. So gets, who gets shut down? This energy. Four of pentacles. They're not going to talk. So in this current transit with them, okay, so now I'm feeling helpless. But this person is relentless because the only thing that they have is a five. And it's not. It's an uncomfortable number, right? Meaning they're going to go to the six because this person is the six. They're going to keep the, the, the problem with the six of pentacles if they go there is they're going to keep giving still to the other person. Win-win, this person still wins. This is not a, a wi who's winning or not. But from what I'm sensing, this person would get what they need and what they want in their life on a soul level. However, this person is the chaser. And this chaser over here will not stop the full card. Okay? So I'm going to continue this reading by seeing how it pans out further, meaning how we can close it for 2017 and combining both of your energy to proceed to 2018. Isn't that lovely, Pisces? Now, Go down there in the show more box. I'll see you and have a happy, happy holiday. Bye.